What if I told you that you can screenshot any website, mobile or tablet apps interface and use that as a working design frame? Introducing Wizard.io, an AI-based software for UI UX designing and brainstorming to help you build websites or applications interface based on your unique needs. And in this video, I will be showing you how to navigate the Wizard tool. Log into Wizard.io on your web browser. Upon logging in, you will be welcomed to a page where you will fill out some basic information. Once you fill that out, you will be taken to the landing page of Wizard. You can create a new project for mobile, web or tablet from scratch here. And I have already worked on one. You can use Auto Designer powered by AI to help you with a particular requirement. You can access presets with visual and design components. Most of these are available only for pro users. Now, let's explore how to build a project from scratch. Choose the option that best suits your requirement from mobile, tablet or web. On the left hand side, you can see different options that add to the visual components of your project. Let's try out some of these. You can customize each of these elements as seen here. At the bottom, you can see the magic icon, which allows you to try out various AI-powered options to enhance your project. On the right side of the screen, you can experiment with the design and interact options, add more screens, add comments, and switch between mock-up mode and wireframe. The handoff option can be accessed only by pro users. You can also access some more settings options here and get acquainted with the wizard community and keyboard shortcuts. A highlight feature of Wizard is how you can import a screenshot of an app interface or scan a wireframe and use it as a working frame for your design. Quite cool. Another feature that stands out is the beta version of Generate with Auto Designer. This works as well as the text to image or video generation AI softwares. You can input the prompt here and auto generate a design interface that you can work with. Well, that was a basic tutorial on how you can utilize wizard.io for your interface design needs. I hope you found this video helpful and if you want me to demonstrate other interesting AI-based tools, do let me know in the comments below.